The Raptors are inching closer to the halfway mark of their season. While their G League team, the Raptors 905, are just tipping off on a condensed season, it will be taking place in the same bubble-like scenario in Disney World that the Raptors played in last summer. It's been a quick ramp-up period. I think we've we got 15 games in 25 days or something like that. So, uh, you know, we're just, you know, praying for everyone's safety to, to keep them safe and healthy. And, and, you know, let's go out here and play some games. The 905 and the rest of the G League were unable to finish their last season because of the global pandemic. The team has been waiting patiently on the sidelines for almost a year. They have finalized their 13-man roster, which includes 2014 NBA draft pick and Mississauga native Nick Stauskas. It's a very exciting team. Um, I mean, the G League as a whole this year, all the rosters are stacked. We, we've got... Um, Probably a little bit better shooting team than we've had in the past. The 905, who would normally travel up a congested Gardner Expressway to the Scotiabank Arena from Mississauga, will have a bit of a longer commute from Orlando to Tampa if they get the call up. We still are, are nearby, so guys will have to undergo a, a quick little quarantine, uh, four days that Malachi just went through. Um, but, you know, he's here and he's ready to participate. Going back to Tampa, he can get back uh, and participate the same day. So it's a, it's a great opportunity to us that we can get guys down to us, uh, they can get some reps in, get their confidence, and then they can get back to the Raptors and hopefully hopefully contribute. Raptors 905. The 905 won the championship just a few years after they joined the league. They have a reputation of building and developing great NBA players. Norman Powell, Fred Van Vliet, Chris Boucher, and Pascal Siakam all spent time with the Raptors farm team. They're humble guys. They come in ready to work. They buy into our system and, and kind of what we are all about. And the, again, that's that's what we look for is guys who are bought in to, to what we're trying to do. What they are buying into is a franchise that continues to set the standard on and off the court for greatness. The team was just awarded the G League Franchise of the Year award by the NBA. It's a huge award uh, that we're, we're all very excited about. Um, I think this shows recognition to everyone who started the team five years ago, to everyone who's a part of it now. The Raptors are in action tonight, taking on the Wizards in Washington. There's a lead to get it, they score it. While the Leafs are taking on the Habs in Montreal. Leaves it back for a nurse three. In the WNBA, Canadian Kian Nurse was part of a blockbuster deal that saw her being traded from the New York Liberty to the Phoenix Mercury. I can't believe she missed it. A disappointing exit from the Australian Open for Bianca Andrescu, who was eliminated in the second round. But grab your popcorn because our Canadian pals Dennis and Felix will be squaring off in the third round. For City News, I'm Lindsay Dunn.